In the hole you go, Monzil. Close her up, Goody. All right, Claude. Gonna be a long night. Wood. Lots of fans, Dub. Bash his head in. Come on now, bash it. Simmer down, fellas. You get your boy as soon as we get ours. Now, don't swell. Drop that pepper box in the dirt. Real friendly like, or I'll drop this hammer on you and send you on your way. You hear? Small hole. You can get in there. Now what? Real good. This real good. Turn us loose! You gonna leave us chained out here like a pack of hounds? Take it easy on him, boys. Get up, Keith! Get up, Keith! You ain't nothing like stealing an all-dog's horse! 
On his fanny. Well, look at him. Look at that. Well, well. Could have taken you for a leprechaun. Yeah, Tom. Come on. Looks like we're going to need a treasure oh, hunt. Come on. God damn. Here. <clears throat> Jesus Christ. Like a bunch of cackling hens. Let's get a hinge of this here. Galveston? Hell, that's 60 miles from the strike. That spurs you made it. Well, after all that hell popped out, and I got separated from you boys, I had to stash it. I mean, my mayor never would have made it back to New Mex with 300 pounds of gold on it. I mean, not with me, at least, Wes. Yeah, well, it didn't make it neither way, you ninny. Hell, we thought you was dead till we heard you sent up. That's got to be 500 miles from here. Well, I wish I was dead after spending six months in that outfit. Yeah. I was lucky my mayor made it as far as Pecos. Good you didn't give him a drop on us, Jack. But after we busted your hawks out of the pokey, the big question is, is what's in that hard melon? The same as on here. Identical. That's my third draft. I burnt the first two. Did you twit? <laughs> what you kicking about now, huh? Don't trust Jack no more? Hell, he took an act of Congress to get you out of New Mex. And now, you're belly aching about 500 measly miles between us and retirement? We're pressing on. Ain't that right, Block? We shall reap the fruits of our journey. I think the big question is, are you going with us? I'm not just going. I'm the one taking us here. And you best not misremember that. All right. I'd rather be running hard than not, though. This is what we do. <laughs> oh, hey, whoa, whoa. Whoa, look there, look there, hey. Up your damn vest, you little nidget! Gather round, fine folks. Woody and Willie's wonderful wagon of wares. Do the, the boys. Uh, yeah, yeah. What do we got today, Willie? Well, Woody, we got ourselves a special wonder potion. Well, wonder potion? Can it do wonders on the piles? Because I got them so bad my wood's starting to canker. <laughs> well, ain't that the dickens? <laughs> well, this could be your miracle cure. It's good for everything from gout to unpleasant mouth odor. Even takes out stains and such. You don't say. Well, maybe you can get this blue belly blood off of my uniform. <laughs> it sure can. Here, let me show you. Oh, oh. God. I, 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 I got it. I got uh, it. Yeah, you, would you gentlemen excuse us for just a moment? Get in there. Get in there. I'll show you. You little poop dog. Uh, yeah. Oh, you! Ow! 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 It's a hindrance! It's all... Ow! Ow! Ow. I'm, I'm sorry! I, oh, you sorry. I should never have taken you out of that damn circus. Oh, I see that now. <laughs> I didn't mean to. I didn't, didn't mean to. I didn't mean to. Sorry! Ow! 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 Not in the kingdom come, mister! No, 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 no,
Bon, voilà. Son. Kidnap him? My name's Paul. Stolen from a traveling show to sell his wares. We're a bunch of outlaws, ain't we, Tom? Might be nice to have an innocent face with us. This might be pinned up all over God's creation soon enough. I, I, I can throw a bowie knife straighter than any pistol ball. Hear that? Good. You're hired. Boys, rustle through that Our farmer's got one of them fancy motor carriages, too. Damn telephone to every apothecary. Well, life's in jeopardy, boys. <clears throat> That's dandy and all. We ain't got a pot to piss in. These meager fixings won't get us past tomorrow. Yeah. Well, it's gonna take a little green to get that gold. Union Express runs right through here. Now, the way I figure it, one score leads to another score. Amen. Oh. Hear that? Paul, breathe easy now. Whoo, goody. Come close to ended up in a pine box sneaking up on us like that. And the darkness breeds an evil spade. The gun down, Block. Hell's bells. Look like you didn't busted out the wrong rascal, mon ami. Now, this is our Tyro Willie. Slapjack's over yonder. Hey, goody. Come here and fix up some of your goodness, huh? Come on, cook us up something good. He's gonna be with us for the duration. Eh? Duration? We here already, ain't we? Yeah, well, Slap couldn't handle the ruckus, so he uh, squirreled the bounty in Galveston. Galveston? Mm hmm. You mean we's going all the way back? Yep, at the bottom of a well to boot. Ain't that a bad break? Spit. Go ahead, boy. He's just trying to fix you, right? The hell you been, anyhow? And so I was off scouting head after I dropped y'all boys off in the holes. Come up on a pair of drovers on their way to Junction, see? Turns out they's pole put men, and they's carrying a ton of mug of money with them, too. Some big mission over at the Lutheran house. And yea, the Lord provided in this time of drought. I was brought up Orthodox myself. That's right. Chapel. Yeah, we could take that as easy as falling off a log. Junction's no slouch of a town. Cussed old sheriff is handling this sheriff highwayman. Yeah, need a way to ward off prying eyes in. A diversion of sorts, exactly. Might be I can help you fellers. <laughs> Come on, do it again. <laughs> it's funny. <laughs> Welcome to Willie and Woody's wonderful world of wares. Sheriff, get in here. Come in here. Today, we have a marvelous new elixir that is sure to get rid of all your woes, whimpers, and willies. You can trust me, my son. Ah, 
I was with my idiot sidekick here. See? And, oh God, Horace. I didn't see Horace, you can't even imagine. Oh, Lord, help me. I can't live with a sidekick. I'm so fast, the Lord. It's the demon. It's choking me. It's choking me from inside. Yeah, it's okay. Help me. Got themselves a Gatling gun. We'll take to the trenches, Woody. Here comes the Gatling gun. I'll get the mess of water. that come from? be damned. Look it. He made it. <laughs> Hot damn. That was right out of a nickel book. Glad you could join us, son. Where to next, boys? Thank you very much. Maybe even us devil took out the line. Yeah, it was devils, all right. Five of them. Run this to Kerrville, son. Put it in the hands of Sheriff Egan. Tell him to flash it out all ever which way. Expect you back tomorrow evening. Be safe. Why are you sending that boy out? Why don't you do it yourself, Sheriff? Yeah. Yeah. Folks, folks, folks. Just take it easy now. 
I leave out of here, them rustlers is liable to double back and hit the savings bank. My duty's to the safety and well-being of this here county. That's right. That's right to serve and protect. And you got a problem with it? Drop your comments in the box outside the sheriff's office. As you put in the soup. By nothing but a clover to Mr. McDonald. Just finish on up. Oh, you put something in this soup. I know it. Just relax, mister. Oh, yeah. I know you put something in it, damn it. What is it, you rogue? <laughs> huh? Let go of my wife. Yeah. Well, you fix my horse right smart. Huh? No need to kick none. I'm gonna help you. Yeah? Well, don't provoke me! It'll all be over in a few seconds. Of your sloppy mouth. Clamp it before you end up next to him. What about your sons? It's no profession, Rudy. There's other means. Like what? Send you back to Horton? You couldn't turn a nickel with it. Pluned up the voice, gussy of yours. <laughs> I should have left you months ago. Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! There. There's your mother to keep you company. Now you two think about what you've done. What's going on? Pull some water up, fetch some ramps. Ain't no flop house. You can't just barge in here like nobody's business. Hot water? Bandages now. <clears throat> some whiskey. Please. Right away, sir. And I'll warm up some soup. <sighs> Get that chair, man. Ah, the 
the big fella looks like he might need a little extra spice, yeah. There you go. Have mm. mm. I seen your picture in the paper? No, sir. These hills used to be my haunts. Maybe we had some dealings before. Candy will ruin your appetite. Yeah, well, stenching here ain't helping much either. I'm sorry, boys. Afraid I've neglected my house duty some since my wife's passing. Ain't you hungry, none? I'll full up. for bringing these gentlemen to my presence. I ask that you take their hands and welcome them to their final destination. Amen. What the hell went on here? Son of a bitch. Bastard hit me in the head. I could have swore last night I saw him. Good old Jack. Body burn. Same as his soul. Brother Scott, did they mention anything about where they was headed? Well, no. One goes by the name of Claude. The hobble one called him that. Claude, huh? What the name of them fellows stopped that Houston Central car before Christmas, Pete? Nixon gang. And they run with the Claude. Barbie, if I'm not mistook. Hey, hey, might that be a uh, sweet tooth, Barbie? Kill them three fellas off that train? Clean that one on pig for me. There's a pretty penny on his hide, Sheriff. You reckon it's him? How many horses have we got fit to ride? Oh. Look down here, fellas. How you mean? We gotta keep moving. We're gonna take the background a spell. We got two dead preachers wearing our bullets. Huh? They're gonna have a posse up our ass any minute now. Yeah, and I'll be damned if I'm gonna let them get a downhill pull on us. Let the blasted long arms pass us up. Put some space twixt us. Now, come on. What you proposing now, Tom? Let's stay in on a change of route. First daylight, we're gonna make a light tracks right through the heart of Austin. Huh. Smack dab in the middle of an army of law dogs. Clever. Why don't we just dally a while and get our picture made? It's exactly what they're not expecting us to do. Austin got steel trees, high as them clouds. Light up the town like ten moons. Oh. 
Oh, thank goodness. Friends, do you have any water? I ran out about a mile back. Yeah, we got a creek down by camp. Where you headed? Kerrville. To deliver a telegram. Some bummers plundered a church in Junction. Is that right? Killed two pastors. Gathered them fresh horses, Sheriff. Looked in on Martin's kinfolk, too. I ain't seen him all week. Mm. Say he's been acting queer, giving to mistreating animals and such. That's how come he's on a bicycle. Mm. You reckon he's run into danger? Well, if it's a Nixon gang run through here, it could be a mess of it. Imagine for a minute, we's the ones holding them scalawags. Save that kid. Huh? We'd be pride of Texas. <laughs> Prized with the prize. What are you thinking? I'm thinking about that reward. And Martin's well-being, of course. Of course. Best get them horses shod and fed before morning. Yes, sir. I say we take the buggy with them first. Rub them with honey, and then stake them over that there uh, bed. <laughs> wait, wait. I can be bad, too. Not like you boys. <laughs> Is that right? Is that right? I can't. <laughs> You hear that? I don't hear a squat. You with anyone? on a man. Maybe you <laughs> Topers, cork it off! Where you mark every damn one of us out here? <laughs> Go to bed. Everybody up! Martin gave us the slip. God damn it, Tom! I told you to keep the skin eye on him. Tom. Tom. Boss. 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 Oh, you got a fever or something? He dead. Son of a bitch, Martin slit his throat! Can't be. He ain't got a drop of blood one. Ticker must have just done stopped. Perhaps a serpent spit venom upon his bread. A wicked ebony serpent. Or a fatherless tramp with a ham puppet. Hey! Now, I ain't had no count killing. Everybody just hush up. Nobody killed nobody. All right? Tom wasn't exactly no spring chicken by any stretch. Came to the end of his trail, that's all. Can I, uh, get to digging a grave, Claude? Nah, we ain't got no time for no ceremony. No telling how long that courier's been on foot. 
The boys gather the horses. I'll say a few words over. Get on the scout, Goody. I dragged Tom by the creek. All right, boss. Yeah, y'all All right, gentlemen. Martin is gone missing. The damn cable's still on the fritz. We have reason to believe the Nixon gang blew through here. Here tell they killed 60 men. They ain't counting pepper bellies and half breed. Yeah, that's why we're here today. Putting it to you boys to volunteer. Now get deputized and stand in with us. Volunteer? <laughs> to go belly up? Hogwash! Volunteer to hunt down them back shooting bastards. Put your name in the mouths of all men. Get a little richer in the process. Any takers? We'll go, sir. That's what I want to hear. I'm gonna hang a story on so we hold up here for the night. I don't want any rough and sprint day. Oh, 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 that? You hear that? Bang, 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 bang! <laughs> you got me there, buddy. Denton! <laughs> Denton! Denton, come here this instant! Sorry. He's been cooped up all day. That's all right. The cat's away, the mice do play. Speaking of, Mom and Pa around? You say you gentlemen are cattle traders? Yes, sir. I'm working stock out west. Oh, I guess we've been moving east for a few days now. Mm. Pardon my excessive queries. It's just we've been on edge since we got wind of a few unsavories in the area. They answer well to your appearance. Is that right? Held up a Lutheran church. Executed the entire parish. Imagine that. <coughs> Ladies and gentlemen, performing tonight, my sister Mary, the best assaultress in all of Texas. And yours truly, Denton Wilberforce, tickling the ivory. Children, no recital tonight. These men are jaded. Oh, that's all right. Been under whipping spurs so long, it'd be nice to mix it up with a bit of a spectacle. Go ahead. <laughs> the eyes of Texas are
Got my mama's jewelry box, too, but she's got the key. Break that open, enough in there to probably pay you back plus so. Well, you know, you're hard workers, and I appreciate that, and it's the least we could do. <laughs> it might just work out fine. Absolutely mad? Your weaker roll straight to the bone archer. What's wrong with you? What's got the hand on? Can't do it. Run and hide, didn't you? Go! Okay, Pop. There's gonna be no way to make it. Stealing this kind of crazy side, Missa. No! I don't know who you people are, but I sense you were bad company the moment I laid eyes on you. Good Lord says. To judge folks without warrant. Can I follow that word? The plain fact is, the whole lot of you just drags on your way to perdition. So I may as well just do the unchristian thing to help you along. Starting with you. That's all right, let her go. There ain't no need to separate a boy from his ma. Now let's saddle up those horses. Huh. Damn. Walks on two legs. Right, let's get out of boys. Let's get out the mat. Hey, what about the ankle biter? <laughs> She'll be back for him soon enough. Saddle me up one of his horses. Let's get the hell out of here. Come on. I reckon it was an engine, boys. Probably skipped the reservation like old Black Horse back in 76. Oh, I don't know. Oklahoma's an awful long way to come just to put a tail on us. A ghoulish raven doth haunt our crusade. Besides, ain't no engine gonna hack up an easy $50 just like that. Huh? Hell, yeah. there's only one way to play hide and seek with a buck. That's draw him out of the bush. Ready to go with the lace? You get your banana peel, boy? Really? Oh, hot damn. I never pickled a girl before. I shall not darken the door of a den of sin. Well, hallelujah, Block. You can be the rubberneck then. <laughs> All right, let's duck back in here. Go. <laughs> Denton! I don't see him anywhere. 
Birds done flown, Sheriff. No sign of the boy, neither. How many of them were there, ma'am? There were four. One was badly wounded. The bearded one took my Mary away. <laughs> they claimed they were cattlemen. One had, uh, had pistols with ivory handles. That sounds like Barbie's hardware. I know for a fact he carries two pearls. I know it's hard, ma'am. But can you remember anything else? The, the lame one was outspoken. He mentioned they were headed to the coast. Thank you, ma'am. We'll find him. You might want to check out front, Cher. Come on, let's go. Back to horn to make me some money. Don't get. It. Cash, fat snacks. Here's the devil's work. Can't have no pot. We'll kindly commiserate with Mrs. Wilberforce. Return to the mission, summon a corn. Sheriff, I don't know what part of hell they're from. I'm so sorry we disappointed you. Come on, Pete. You what, sure has been Cracker Jack riding with you fellas. It ain't dishwater, but it ain't gonna get us the coast now either. Uh -huh. Good outlaw, never stay satisfied. About time you loafers then showed up. Ran into a bit of a hitch over in K-Town. Keep your eyes on the fix, might have a shadow or two. You know there was a whole lot of chatter in my ears too, boss. I reckon you's getting more popular by the day, Monsieur. <laughs> you ever wonder what it'd be like to buckle down on some hard work, Jack? 
I ain't talking about petty thieving. I'm talking about an honest trade. Hell, maybe even marry a starry bell. No. Oh, would you play checkers with your nose? Yeah. Guess you're right. You hear that? Same noise. Your hands high then. You. Me. Willie. You have a horse. How long you been trailing us? Since you stirred up that fracas at the Lacey. Bastard Bud's been due for a dust-up for a long time now. Kind of nice seeing somebody nervy enough to stand up to him. Is that right? And then it got me thinking. All those years horned for Bud, and I got nothing but a curious itch. <laughs> so, uh... I started studying a new line of work. Outlawing ain't no place for a woman. Well, let me be blunt. You see, I got things you boys are lacking. Things uh, that can be mighty distracting. Call me Pearl. Though he was chained hand and foot, and kept under guard. He'd broken his chains. Had been driven by the demon into the darkness. That's deep. Lucky that bell didn't land you dead. That sounds making me a bit touchy late. Hey. Don't mind him none. He's just checking mojo. <laughs> What's wrong, sir? Get some winks. I can't. Not after your horse got all diced up like that. Then you be the night hawk, then. You get tired, let Blocky relieve you. Now go on. Cut up your horse? Where's the need? You sure do have a knack for finding trouble, don't you? Yeah, well, pretty good at finding me, too. Besides, engine done that. Ever met one that liked a pale face anyhow? But I bet they'd fancy a little desert flyer like you. Not too hard on the eyes, if you don't mind me saying. You're not too bad yourself. A little rough around the edges, but nothing a fine lady couldn't smooth out. Hmm. If you don't mind me saying. Not too bad, huh? Well, that's a start. What's a sharp wit like you running around with rabble like this? Doesn't make a lick of sense. Hell, makes a lot of sense if you're in a pinch. These chaps here can sling lead with the best of them. <laughs> <laughs> Might not be much on words, but that's what my mama's for. Smallpox took mine. But I was just a girl. Yeah. Mine was barely grown. She had me and my twin brother. Got a little weary of our hell raising. Sent us off. And I hadn't seen her since I was a spud. That's why I got the Ezo. Keep her close. They're gorgeous. Sell sea pearls from the outback. Daddy stole them off a Mexican Madam Morris. Made my mama a fine gift, too. Hell, I could buy 400 head of beef for these. Memory's worth more than gold to me, though. They're so extravagant. May I hold them? I 
Let's call it a night. Sleep. Let's get in the cup, boys. See what this day brings. See if Miss Pearl's worth a salt. Well, let me just go freshen up. I don't trust her, boss. I seen her juju. I show up, Goody. I'm about tired of your flap doodle this week. I've never seen nothing like it. Eyes black as pitch. Hands faster than two rattlesnakes. He worked them two pearly handled sixers faster than the eye could see. I don't mind telling you. Grabs two handfuls of candy and hightails it out of there. Come to love. What's all the hubbub? Sweet Tooth Bobby, that's what. Where can we have a word with the sheriff? Right over there. Don't know how much you get out of him, though, seeing as he's dead. Sorry to hear it. Well, you better speak up if he's going to hear it. <laughs> Have we got here? That's what, Pearl? All right, Jimmy. Where's the money at? No, no, sir. I got nothing. Yeah, I go and sell these furs on the market. And if you catch me on the back way, maybe I'll have me some notes. But uh, luck I have it, I'm broken in the old Major Hill hound. In fact, all I got to my name is a 50 cent piece. Got to nothing but pelts. Ain't that the trots? Son of a bitch. Get a rope. Skip it. Ah, damn. Get his boots up from the tree. Come on. I'm just checking to see if you folks will settle for the night. Need anything, don't hesitate to call. Oh, and by the way, don't forget to lock your doors. There's been talks of Sweet Tooth Barbie in the region. Now, who's that? Oh, you don't know? Well, Cable says he's only the biggest gun to hit the area since Bass himself. Says you'll know him by his spiffy get up and pinch it for taffy. Watch out, though. People say he's got thin skin and a hair trigger. They also say he smells like curry and has these abnormally almost baby-like digits. He carries these two rose-carved, pearly-handled uh, sh shooters. Uh, you might as well get comfortable, boy. Had to do it. What you got? Two lawmen just checked in, looking for you. Is that right? You think they might be onto us? No, but I think you should warn the others. Yeah. Now you're thinking like an outlaw. It's us coat you wear, son. Sweet Mariana, 
a pickle. Anybody need the boots fit, Shaq? Ow! All right, enough of the grab assing, boys. Now listen up. We got a couple badges checked in. We hit the saddle at five before they open their lids. Comprende? See? All right, now, good night. Porter, a couple of coffees, pour for four, black. Right away, sir. Barbie's no different than any other blowhard out there. More blows than hard. Fellas think they're hot tonight. Ain't nothing. I'm sorry, it's just sweet tooth. <laughs> not very intimidating for a road agent. No, it's not. Spend all these years trying to make a name for myself, and then they go and make a mockery out of me like that. It should be something like, uh, Claudacious Barbie. <laughs> it's got a ring to it, right? No. Oh, don't put a long face. It takes a lot of bark to throw aside caution in a scrape like that. The way you handled that, Sheriff. Yeah? Mm-hmm. I was pretty sneaky, wasn't I? Mm-hmm. <laughs> but that ain't gonna get us to the coast. What's at the coast? <laughs> Is it legal or illegal? Yeah, what's legal? <laughs> Legal tender. Mm. Not that it's any of my affair, but uh, just how legal. King's ransom legal. The gang know? Yeah, they know. But I got the map. Mm. Left a little love note. been tied up all night. Sweet Tooth took my clothes and only ran off with your pocketbooks. Dog-eating scum sucking son of a bitch! Damn it, Peek! Let's get out of here! I've seen things tonight that a man wouldn't do to a farm man.
sure can't wait to weigh my pockets down with them riches claws. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm getting my foot patched up, giving me a new finger, and a couple of grade A whores. <laughs> Feel the measure of my pleasure. With some whiskey and women, boys. Be happier than a pig and shit. <laughs> <laughs> How about you, Block? I'll walk with Claude till I'm called home. All right. Okay. Quiet. Hear that? Yes, the bounty. Show your feathers, you brave bastard. Come on. It's probably just a lost heifer club. Well, I got a toy too. Listen up. Oh. We'll flush them out in the morning. You ain't done us no harm. Yeah, well, I aim to keep it that way. I'm on perch tonight, boys. now. Willie, up. Oh, Jesus Christ. Damn. I told you that woman had woman mojo, but you ain't want to listen. Now look, she done took and killed Willie. The strength was as crooked as the path to hell. Now listen, now Pearl might be a leg spreading thief, but she sure as hell ain't no murder. This here's the handiwork of a renegade red ass gonna matter in a coup. Jack ain't looking too good, boss. He green as a cucumber. He smelling like yesterday's milk. Why don't you, uh, why don't you just go along without me, huh? What? Like hell. Like hell I am. All right, Goody, <sighs> make a round around the camp. Curry comb every niche, every holler. Why don't you try to pick up that bastard's trail? Lock, stay here. Do not leave Jack. Got it? I'm gonna run into LaGrange, try to find the sawbones. I expect Willie planned it before I get back now. Mighty big rattler done that. <laughs> they might feel something now here. <laughs> this heat gangrene's gonna set right in quick. I recommend he stays oh. off that foot for at least a week. Now, I don't know what transaction... Weeks too long, what else we got? I can amputate. Uh -huh. That'll work. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh. <laughs> you ain't lumping off a damn tootsie! No. We gotta get a move on. Hounds almost had us treed. Rogue Indian took out little Willie. Oh. Every minute we burn, that whore's getting further and further from us. But we, oh, I can't, come on. I like to kick a hog every now and then. You know that, Claude, please. You kick all the hogs you want, we get there. I don't give a cuss. Hell, I even buy your peg leg. <laughs> this outlaw's gone to your damn head, Claude. <sighs> You're all about the greenbacks now. <laughs> Ain't that right, Mr. Sweet Tooth, huh? 
There wouldn't even be any grain if I didn't bust your keister out of prison now, would there? And you won't have a goddamn map if you left me in prison, huh? I don't have the map, Slap! That's why we gotta cut your darn foot off. Sheriff, ought to get us at least through the next couple, two, three days. Good work, Pete. So what now? Dr. Pepperdine, are you okay? <laughs> oh, please excuse my appearance, fine folk. I was hornswoggled by a group of stick-up men. They were pretending to be marshals. You catch any names, Doc? Yes, I did. One of them went by the name of Claude. Caught that during an argument over a map. Before they had their way with me. He's on the outskirts, Sheriff. Put my dang shoe. That's sweet too. All right, folks. Doc here just had a run-in with the Barbie gang. They're giving us fits now for the better part of a week. They're wanted for a string of heinous offenses statewide. We act fast, though. We've got a good shot at hunting them down. We're offering a share of the reward, plus $100, to any man who will join up with us and bring him to justice. Well, come on, step up now. Don't be shy. I'm no hunter, Sheriff, but I do have a little secret might be worth sharing. You can call me Ruby. <laughs> no! <laughs> Get your hands off of me. <laughs> Got it. Ain't no chieftain after all, boys. You know, ain't got time for this shit. Blocky, how about a Texas slinger? <laughs> Lord shall judge the quick and the dead. <laughs> bit of a ring to it. Como se llama, sombre? Ricardo Diaz, de Rio Rico. No, don't ring a bell. Good knowing you, dick. This is for Willie. Good night. All right, let's push on through the night. Nab them before they ever get to Galveston. I reckon she'd just blow and smoke up our petunia, Sheriff. Ruby? Nah. She's real as a rabbi. I wouldn't put a past old Barbie sending a pretty gal to slip us up. She's after a share of that reward, same as you and me. They could be halfway to Laredo by now. I suspect they're after a pile of that rail job booty they botched in Houston. If I was a bandit, this here stretch of seclusion would be my sunset route. Come on, let's go. Come on. Shit fire. Why can't we ever ambush some damn Italians? Give me some of that tortellini, huh? Say, boss. Yeah. You show that pepper the one put Willie's plug? Hell yeah, I'm sure. And a whole family of scalps, one of them just as straight and black as Willie's locks. Well, I ain't taking no chances. Mm -mm. Now, I'm laying right here next to this damn fire so I can see any son of a bitch come to call. Click. <laughs> you do that, he's young called night. 
Who's in that stuff, did he? Damn, nothing fancy over here, mon ami. Something like this, Claw? He ain't after no reward. This is someone with some serious mental shocks. He might not even be a human kind. Terror bestows those who embrace evil. Maybe we should call the tits up and head back to New Mexico. I'd rather be in prison than hell. Not a chance. We're riding like hellfire till we hear those waves breaking on the shore. Man, animal, demon, whatever he is, he won't screw with us, that's fine. No skin off my back. You have to wash out each one of us before I'm left. You hear that? I'm calling you out! It'll be a cold day in hell before you back down to Bobby Gang! <laughs> Beans is still warm, Sheriff. We're getting closer. Ain't gonna be much to get close to. There's that circular mark again. What do you make of it? Don't. Seems to favor the dead, though. Let's hope it ain't contagious. That old plug's nearly broke, Paul. She's never gonna make it. El Pearl must be at least 15 miles ahead of us for now. We'll double up if we got to. We'll be covering her foot loose if we don't water these horses here. I mean, look at your mare, she's spent. Damn it. All right, we'll camp in this field then. No fire. Not tonight. And when I return, my stench will rise in these fields. Amen. Don't go too far, Block. Hey, Jack. Yeah? You ever think that maybe God's playing some cruel joke on us? How do you mean? Well, it just seems like such a tangle. Take a good time to fashion each one of us, drop us off down here in this world. Just to bob around year after year. Collect wealth, whiskey, women. Then he makes some mad hatter, picks off one by one. Sticks out in the middle of this wheat field, cold, hungry. Betrayed. She seems a little sick, that's all. Well, what if God didn't make it? You plugged up? Oh, hell. I gotta go check on you. Stay right here. Don't move. Block. Get you son of a bitch!
Where is it? Back back. Oh, we just checked. You still out there? What was? Where's Mark? I see him. Darker and well digger's ass out there. Right, grab your eyes. Uh -huh. They moves with the grass. Plug it to go. Three Jesus. Oh, just relax. Come on. The trees. I'm sorry, Block. I think we need to get this to you. Take care of me and help. Because I'm going to send him there right behind you. seen fit. You're wanted for the murder of ten men, not including four of your own. My deputy Peak was among them. Yeah, well, I laid claim to the first ten, but I ain't ever touched a single one of my own men. Either way, that's an awful bloody grave you're sleeping in. Disgorge. I'll heat it up for you in there. Come to the end of your saga, sweet tooth. Time to face the music. Yeah, well, I don't cut that so much. I got one of my own. You want to hear it? Yeah, I'm listening. Old MacDonald had a farm. E-I-E-I. <laughs>
can almost hear the ghost. Oh, come yeah. on. Don't hold back on account of me. No, I won't have it. We're 50-50 now. We're 50-50. This was real deep. I don't think I'm gonna make it. Right, now close your eyes and just bear down. It's gonna hurt me more than it does you now. They never trust a man whose heart ain't been broken. See, our pa's left us both when we were youngsters. Ma's did everything they could to raise us right, but there's always that emptiness between us. I sensed it from day one. The fact is, I trusted you more than any of them. That's God's honest truth. Trust that you too, Pa. But there is one thing about it. About what, the map? What do you mean, Slap? What do you mean there's one thing about it? Water hole. Water hole? What about the water hole? Oh. For the pig and string. Pig and string? Yeah. What do I do with the pig and string? Holy. 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 Pig and string. Holy. Holy.
kid. You mean to tell me that we've been hunted this whole time by a measly little pipsqueak runt? Where's your toy now, huh, boy? You hear me? I'm talking to you. You might have marked this little snot nosed mongrel. I'll be damned if you can cut me up. See that? Flames, boy. I'm sending you to hell. Sending you home early. Ought to sit you boy the fire gates. You stop keeping that bell, go check on him. You're delirious, sweetie. <laughs> no matter me, though. Head's worth a year's pay. Crazy or not. Well, it'll be worth a whole lot more. Only use a little late.
Thank you.